police. Police. As good as police. Just say I'm police. Everyone say I'm police for now. The characters all talk in slightly different ways. Rabbit talks very much like someone from the early 70s. One, expect very bad word of mouth. Two, we're the Met and you're fucking nicked. Rabbit is happy to be doing a job which pays and distracts him from drinking. Gin's literally blinding. You better take it with a mixer. I'll have a whiskey, Gwen. He's really tough. You can punch him several times and he won't feel anything. It's gone again! Come on! Uh, now, girl. Uh, OK, ready? Oh. Mabel talks something like people do today, and Strauss talks like he's from about 1943. Can I just say, I've had the most incredible time. Good boy. Strauss has just finished a degree in criminology at Cambridge. He's keen to prove himself in a more urban environment, but he thinks of it all a little bit like he's off to a cricket match. How long do these things usually last, Inspector? I have a pulling cramp. As long as it takes, son. The trick is to stretch out every half hour. And if you get too cold, yes. piss yourself. <laughs> So much they didn't teach in college. Mabel is an aspiring police officer, except our comedy is set in the Victorian era, so uh, women didn't really have the freedom to do all that much. The only opportunity for a young woman in this field is strangled girl in fog. I'm aiming higher. Over the course of the series, we see her become the first Victorian policewoman. There's no glass ceiling anymore because I smashed the fuck out of it. I am Alan Armstrong and I play Chief Inspector Wisbeach. What we really needed for the character of Wisbeach is someone who can come in and tell him what to do and you believe that he would do it. You bloody do what I bloody say, when I say, until I bloody say, don't do what I bloody say. All right, piss off. He's got this team of ne'er-do-wells who just create problems for him all the time. You know, I wanted Alan Armstrong, you know, and I wanted Freddie Fox, you know, and I wanted Susan, and we got them. Come on in, Mabel. You may not be a fopper yet, but I'll let you walk down the street with us. Wow. What an amazing reward. I know. But I go in the middle. <laughs>